Hello there, this is CSX Derivative, and this is a quick video tutorial on how to deal with large group of, groups of enemies that are higher level than you. First thing that you really need to focus on is planning ahead. So, I'm going to be encountering six Night Stalkers here, and I'm only a level 8 character, and I'm playing on hardcore, uh, very hard. So, this is going to be a really difficult task for a level 8 character to overcome. So, the first thing I did was I told my follower to wait behind me, you don't see him now, but he's behind me on a rock, and the second thing I'm doing is laying frag mines, so that'll be a fallback position. Um, I put on a stealth boy, and originally I was going to use a grenade launcher, but I decided that the rat slayer, which has a times 5 critical, would be best for doing as much damage as possible, because it would allow multiple critical hits instead of just one big boom in hopes of taking them all out. And as you can see here, I'm doing some considerable damage. And here's where the uh, planning comes into play. So I sort of expected to be attacked at some point, even though I was probably disguised in my stealth boy. <laughs> and um, as you can see there, I completely obliterated at least one of those um, night stalkers right there. And the other one is complete is very much damaged. Uh, and there's my follower. So that's the point of having the follower wait back. You tell him to have be in wait position. And so, normally when I tried this earlier, my follower would just get, would just get killed. However, when I uh, told him to stay back, and only run back to him when I really needed him, then he stayed alive, he regenerated health, and I didn't have to deal with the Night Stalkers only attacking him and me being left there to basically watch and die. And so, another key thing to do is watch your health. Uh, although you can't see it immediately because I'm on hardcore mode, the stim packs are going to heal me over time as I make my way back to the area. And I to pull the Rat Slayer back out because once again they don't know where I am because I have the stealth boy on. So basically all you need to do is make sure you need to, you need to make sure you plan correctly because I tried this two or three times different ways and the plan that worked was you need to be stealth stealthy, I guess is the word for that, <laughs> and um, and as long as you uh, get the critical shots with a high critical weapon like the Rat Slayer, which is also silenced so they don't know where you are, they, like, it, you see here that thing doesn't know where I am even though it's right next to me, so I can continue to get criticals on it, and so, yeah, <laughs> I ran out of things to say, that's sort of bad, so how's the weather? <laughs> Um, yeah, it finally found me, so I walked back there, uh, wait, loud boon, and, uh, ran out of, uh, AP there, because the, the Rad Slayer is a 45 action point gun. However, with sniper rifles, you don't really need it, and you, as you can see there, I still got the critical on him, because I'm partially hidden. Here, I thought I was going to die, because I was, it's a normal Night Stalker, not a young Night Stalker, and I got fortunate enough to, uh, have the terrain on my side, I got stuck on that rock, so I could make my way back to Boone, and uh, even then, I had to get that critical strike on the Night Stalker in order to kill it. And so, I guess if I were to say two main points is plan ahead and get high critical, uh, high critical shotguns. So what I mean by that is that you won't be able to take them out with a normal gun, because they're too powerful, they will know how to handle you even if you're using, say, like a 10mm submachine gun on all of them. Because you're going to run out of bullets, you won't be able to run away from them in time, and they'll eventually kill you. However, if you use this, such as the Rat Slayer, a high critical gun, and go ahead, if you see here, I get a one-shot kill on a completely healthy Night Stalker, because it's times five, it's in the head, it's a sneak attack critical, and it basically does work on all of them. <laughs> and... That's basically it. I took down six Night Stalkers in that as a level 8 character using just two Stealth Boys, six Stim Packs, and a Doctor's Bag. And Boon, which is helpful to have as backup. So please check out my other follow videos if you want to know how to get the Rat Slayer. I have that posted. And please be sure to subscribe, comment, rate, and thanks for watching.